What's going on guys? Today I'm making a little lazy lamb recipe. So this is something you want to do. If your kid's giving you a hard time, you want something that tastes pretty good. And it only took me about 20 minutes in total, about five minutes to grab all the ingredients and everything. So first off, we're gonna get our fat cap, sear it in the pan, make sure it's nice and seared, because we know the fat carries flavor and it helps butter up the pan. So you don't gotta use too much extra butter if you're watching your weight. Then I'm gonna season it with a lot of this Kinder's. Got the wood fire garlic, the blend, and also the prime truffle one. And then I'm gonna flip it over. It's looking pretty good. Got a nice little decent char on it. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. And then I put a little more butter in it. And then also I'm gonna throw it in the oven at 300. And after I seared it for both sides, I basically put it at 300 until I got internal temp of 140 degrees. You don't want to overcook it too much because with lamb, it's very unforgiving once you get dry. But as long as you take it out 140, let it rest enough, you'll be good. You'll be good. You could take out 135 as well. But I was a little hesitant today because I didn't let it rest as much as I should because, you know, I was hungry. My kid was going crazy. But anyways, we have the Brussels sprouts. It's my wife's favorite part. Then I'm going to cut the tips off. Pause. And these little things right here, you'd be surprised how good they are. I thought I would never like vegetables, but this is a vegetable I start to love. I seasoned it with the blend and the prime truffle one. And then I let my lamb rest after I took out the oven. I'm gonna put some balsamic vinegar over my sprouts. Get all this Italian water over the balls, pause. And after it mixes up, you dredge them up and it starts to smell pretty good. Add a little more if you want to. I love balsamic vinegar, so I'll put a little more. And then I'm also going to add a little bit of the blend too after I'm done shaking my balls. Pause. But after that, that's about it. This is one of the easiest recipes I'm going to ever post. And it's definitely something that you can get that tastes really good. Feels a little fancy, but also you don't got to break the bank, nor you don't got to break time. This is one of my favorite things. I really hope y'all enjoy. Also, the macros are pretty nice on it. It's definitely something to get your protein and all your vitamins from the veggies up and the dressing i put over is nothing crazy just a little bit of green salsa from cholula and the balsamic glaze over the brush sprouts but yeah this is something i highly recommend and also a nice little surprise dinner for the wifey if you guys ever want to do something quick and easy all right then y'all have a good one